Yo, what's going on, everybody? So we are here at Lightning Fitness, throwing down on a little Arnold Strongman Classic prep. We do have the events we talked about a little bit before. So day one, we have max squat. Excited about that. A 275 dumbbell clean and press for reps. Day two is a max log, meh. Frame carry, meh. And then stone to shoulder. So got to be an interesting show for sure. Today I'm training two of my worst events ever. Super excited to do that. And we are going to hit log first and then head over and do some farmer's carry to work on the grip a little bit. Um, earlier this week, I did some light log clean and press and found out how out of shape I am. And uh, today we'll be going a little bit heavier and seeing how that goes. So pretty excited, feeling pretty good. Body's feeling good. Um, I'm really excited about this max squat. I haven't tested a true max in a really long time. And I get to throw on some squat briefs. So we're going to push for a pretty big number as I think all the other guys are. But uh, we're going to get the log set up and see what we can do tonight. Washed up strong man. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> I'm now a bodybuilder. Whoa, that felt nice. Look at you. It's only acceptable because he owns the place. So Matt actually, Matt turned pro in 2012 as a 105. Uh, was pretty darn successful. And then uh, started getting hurt. A long time. Now he's a bodybuilder. Yeah. Well, I mean, I've known you yep. since 2009. Yep. 13 now, years. That was still a fun show. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. 13 years, yeah. Yep. That's right. I still have that t-shirt, too. I know. Mm -hmm. So. Yep. It's always good when More the first set feels definitely. like crap. You know, but some days when the first set feels like crap, you have really good sets when you get warmed up. That's why I need friends like him. Yep. It does happen like that. <laughs> There's days where things feel great warming up, and then it, your top sets suck. like crap, yeah. And none of it makes any sense. <laughs> That's why I always say I hate this sport. Yeah. That was a little harder than it should have been. Not a fan of that. That was better. Almost like I knew what I was doing there. What weight are you trying to get up to? Tonight? Um, I'll probably just add another 20 pounds, go to 355. Call it there for tonight. Still just, still just fighting it. So we'll see what happens. Got about eight weeks to make it okay. Somewhat competitive. Well, that's not good. 
try that again. Still not amazing, but it's less shitty, so I'll take it. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna do a little frame carry now. Um, obviously at the Arnold, we have the timber frame. So it's 880 pounds, like 400 kilos, up a ramp about 35 feet. So if you watch the Arnold in 2020, you know, I obviously did really, really well at this event. Didn't even move it. So the goal is to maybe pick it up this year. That'd be great. So we're going to train some frame right now, see how it goes, and get out of here because it's late and I'm hungry and tired. Too much leniency in the diet over the vacation. Paying for it now. Still hate this event. This will be an okay place to start if I hit this with some ease. Build off from here. You know, it's, it's an extra 130 pounds on top of this, right? Not great, not horrible, but it's over. Oh. Ow. It just always hurts. All right, so training for tonight's done. Nothing wild, just putting in the work, right? So we're still eight weeks out, just trying to get comfortable with everything again. Feel like I uh, indulged a little bit too much over the holidays. So work on getting rid of this bloat <laughs> and feeling athletic again, but Ended up hitting 355 for a double on the log. Not great, but happy with it. Starting to feel the pattern again, feeling comfortable with it. Um, you know, I missed the first set of two. So I was happy I was able to come back, hit it for another double. And then just ran with 750 on the frame. It, uh, I will say it's a little tough. This frame is a little bit more narrow than what we're gonna be having at the Arnold. So gonna try to figure something else out in training to work on that wider grip, get the upper back and the lats involved a little bit more. Uh, and get more comfortable with something closer to what we're going to be using at the contest because that timber frame is a bitch to say the least so now the training's done it's about 8 30 night i'm gonna head on home take some of my ziggy's natural cbd super excited about that because i want to go to bed get up in the morning hit some cardio because i feel too fluffy and uh you know get ready to attack the rest of the week so as always check out all the sponsors down below in the description like the video subscribe to the channel give us some love and until next time Peace out.